Let's see if we can't do something about my boredom. Deep in the forest of Albion lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times, he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. So this is it. This is the game that destroyed my childlike wonder of video games. This is the game that made me distrustful of every video game afterwards. You've no idea how hyped I was for this game for years. Peter Molyneux just came out, like, towering above me. And he was like, oh, look. He's like, come forth, child, and see the tales of fable, a game where all anything is possible. I was like, really, Mr. Malinu? Really? No fooling? He's like, you're no fooling indeed. And then he shit in my mouth. That was the end of that. That's how that, that ends. What? Uh, I was just... Uh, look, son, <sighs> so we have to do shit around town. Man should be and tell you what. Uh, so... You, this is quote unquote the morality system of the game. We have to start making choices already. We could snitch on this guy, which is a good deed, and our dad will give us money, or we can accept his bribe, which is a bad deed. So, uh. Good lad. My advice. Look after. Alright. I committed an evil deed. Oh no, I'm gonna. The e the morality system of this game is super fucked, by the way. Oh, oh spoiler. I'll be gonna kick this chicken. <laughs> That is one good thing about this game. Oh, chicken chaser. Okay, let's get through the fucking childhood part of this. It's it's a boring fucking slot. You know, I could be describing the whole game. Uh, anyway, this is Fable. It was a game. Hello, um, man. Your trainer. And it seemed it just so happens that Gavin. I'm a Okay, we have to get enough money to buy sweets for our sister, that so that she could disappear forever because she's a blind prophet. Spoilers. Um. I can't remember all the deeds you have to do. What's the scar to say? Right, got you. I've heard reports that you accessory to improv that sort of behavior. If you were older, I like how. So he got word that I didn't tell that guy cheated his wife. So apparently everyone fucking knows about it already. So what's the fucking? Why does it matter? What you got going? Oh, I've got to, you know. Uh. Just stand between. I'll put a good word. Okay. What? He wants me to watch boxes, and then this little shit dick kid comes up, and he wants me to break the boxes. So we have to stand here while he berates us. A lemon? I can't believe I picked this game to be the next magical video game adventure. Um... Let's talk more about how this game was so crushingly Come disappointing. On, it's an, it's honestly back. a semi-decent, mediocre oh, uh, Western action RPG, but 
you don't, you, I mean, you might understand, but this game was built up so fucking high in the minds of everyone, and this and none of its sequels have ever lived up to that. So, God, wasn't it disappointing? I just laid in the floor and wept for days. Thanks, I'll let you... Okay, there's a good deed to counteract uh, adultery or whatever the hell it was we did earlier. So what, that's two gold pieces. What's left? I think our sister's over here. We can't give, we don't have the money to buy sweets for her and then have uh, the village get ransacked. Spoilers. All right, what you guys say? What do you want? He was irritated. No, he won't give it to I told him. Okay, so. I want more pocket money next week. Let's see, he's getting bullied. Okay, we need to beat the shit out of this guy, gotcha. Oh, hold on, I gotta go into combat mode. You know, I just noticed this kid is wearing enormous fucking gloves. I got a teddy bear, okay. Um, I mean, look, it's fucking bizarre. Why would a kid who's, I assume, like seven, need giant fucking smelting gloves? I tell you, it's a game, it's realism. Peter Molyneux, if you're listening, leave me in the comments. Tell me why. Why you hate me and any chance of happiness I could ever have. I think that's your sister right there. He knows everybody's sister. Uh, this is no time for Slowpoke Rodriguez. What's the guard got to say this time? He's like, Oi, listen here. I heard you defeated a boy and then looked at the box as you did. I'm going to kill so many fucking guards when I'm an adult. Hey, lady. What are you about? Where's that filthy lady? With some, I run his house if you find him. Uh, yeah, I'll tell yeah. you about that. Thank you. Okay, so I got a gold coin as a bribe, but then I backstabbed him anyway, which is a good deed according to this game's very loose morality system. So, um, what's left? There's a green thing over here. Well, this is where I already looked at boxes. I don't understand this fucking strange world. Oh, I gotta give her her bear back. Okay. Okay, if we go talk to my dad now, I should be rolling in all that fat cheddar. My dad never offered to give me gold pieces to do good deeds. Alright. This is the worst fucking intro. <laughs> I'm just saying. Kick the shit out of that chicken. It's the only thing keeping us going is the thought of kicking those chickens. Okay, dad. Mm, I'm a man of my... But if you think that I'll turn a blind... up, Look, try... Well... Everyone, how come everyone knows that I took a bribe from an adulterous man? Like, I just... It's, they all have a psychic hive mind connection. Why did the guy even bribe me? He was like, Oh, we don't upload this to the neural net. And my character was apparently from Ghost in the Shell. And everyone knew immediately. Ooh, you're lucky quickly. Young sir. Okay. Chocolates. I'm gonna go give these to my sister and we're gonna live long, happy lives together. Uh, where is my sister? She's up here, isn't she? I, you can actually come back to this town later, and somebody has bought your family's house. So I will probably kill them. Because that shit pisses me off. Because a very similar thing has happened to me in real life, but I won't go into details about that. Hey! Hello, little brother. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is. <sighs> Like you did I guess let's watch the cutscene. I'm just gonna I'm talk over the cutscenes because I don't care right. enough about this game's cutscenes to not talk dreams. over them. I was standing in this field. And, and something happened. happened. I was standing in this field and something the opposite of no, brigands no, ransacking the town. I'm still waiting for my present. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. Did you? It's just like my dream. Every kid in this game has Come the on. most annoying fucking voice, which is really hypocritical coming from me. But that's how bad they are. Okay. I knew you would come on. Let's, Let's go home. Let's go home and live happy lives. And my character's like, yeah, I guess I got these big fucking smelting gloves. I'm gonna kick shit out some chickens. Wait, there's something wrong. Bandits! He's the best band. Is that Louis C.K.? It's really happening. They're here. I like how she's you like, I can predict the future, but oh god, something I predicted happened. And my, my character became Willem Dafoe for half a second. My character looks like he's 40, but just tiny. The best generic bandits. That's, uh, yeah. <laughs> so shocked. All you gotta do is punch him with your big fucking meaty lobster choking hands. 
Tell me what happened, narrator. Let me know the truth. I my heart Evil can't stand that. Come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. I like to think they just had torches and steel ingots, which they threw at people. Apparently, it was very easy to ransack a town. As the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies. <sighs> Let's. Not, we're not gonna watch that cutscene. Your village gets ransacked, and then. You're like, oh no, the tragedy, I'll become a hero. Uh, such convenient fire prevents me from leaving that way. And then a guy, I think his name is Maze. I, I haven't played this game since it came out in 1975 or whenever this fucking game originally came out. But I think his name is Maze. It has to be. He's some kind of creepy magician dude who takes you back to his house. He's like, hey boy, your village burnt down, but that's, your village ain't the only thing getting hot, baby. He's like, why don't you come back to my place? And my character's like, I, there's no chickens left to kick. I have no, <laughs> I have no dream. Yeah, I want to see if his name is Maze. I have to know. Your dad, who was very important to the plot, is dead. His hands are too big! I don't understand it. Uh-oh. Yeah, there we go. We must leave. It's not safe here. Look at that cleft fucking They're chin. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. That is the creepiest fucking man. I probably burned to death in the village. He's got fingerless gloves on too. He's like, I left my fedora at home. Now join me. We go to the land of Mountain Dew and atheism. And now I'm just making shitty internet jokes. This is sub. This is below 10 fake quality. I could do better than this. I could also edit out this saving and loading screen, but I won't. So have fun dealing with that shit. Oh yeah, he vomits I thought you'd have a because stronger he stomach teleports. <laughs> Come on. God, he's so fucking Save Popeye energy, and ready boy. to fight. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you, you know. Where was he when all the bandits stayed, showed up, by the way? BTW. As the rest of them. Like, me. he was just sitting in a barn somewhere, being an asshole, I assume. This game doesn't have... Name is May. Okay, his name... Is, okay, that's the literally the only reason I was watching that cutscene. Was to confirm that his name was Maze. That no one has ever been named that. You can't just take... I mean, you can, because JRPGs and anime have proven this, but you shouldn't just take nouns and make those character names. You'll be sharing this This old man is cool, except he asks us to get our combat multiplier higher all the time. Uh, her, I'm going to kill in a coliseum later. Spoilers. All right. Let's go train, I guess. I'm a wee little lad of... Six summers or in a winter, I don't know. We're at the Guild Hall of Champions. I can fart, by the way, because this game is funny, and then I can giggle about it. Ah, oh, Peter Molyneux. Okay, I think we have to run a little race or something here. I don't. I barely remember. I don't want to remember. <laughs> Please don't make me remember. Hey, uh, Clarence. I don't remember your name. All right, lad. I have to punch this. I've already beat up a bully. Like, I've already won every 80s movie, so why do I have to continue to do this? Not making much of an impact there, are you? Now I use flourishes. Oh, he gave me a weapon, which I didn't have before. Oh, wait, I have to equip that shit. Right? Oh, God, I just remembered this has all kinds of weird shit. I don't, I don't make, you can't, you can't make me remember. Oh god, what a terrible inventory. Wield. Don't equip it, wield it. Because I'm Peter, cocksucking Molyneux, and I hate... Wait. There. I was getting confused because the controls at the bottom are uh, original Xbox controller controls, and it wanted me to press the black or white button, and I completely forgot about the black and white button, which became bumpers. What do you want me to gain experience? He's like, you've well got fat done, XP, you'll be headed in Raid Guild in 30 minutes. Melee combat test passed. You've started a new quest. Okay. I feel like 
do I have to do all these or can I talk to an NPC and be like, I don't want to do all these anymore. And he's like, okay, that's cool, kid. You ain't got to do nothing, babe. This is the world of fable. You, anything's possible. You plant an acorn. I'm like, don't start with the fucking plant an acorn shit. Oh, Jesus. Why, Peter Molyneux? And then Fable 2, he was like, you can do anything, and by if anything means make out with a dog, then yes, you're perfectly capable of it. All right, you what do you want me to do now? You can't expect to... Oh, I have to kill beetles that I didn't know about, gotcha. The Guildwood. Fucking shit. <laughs> this is the angriest, this is Ten Fang's angry video game adventure. Ugh. It would have been fine. If I had just bought this game on a whim back when I had an original Xbox and that was the, the thing that kids played, I'd have been like, this ain't a bad game, son. I mean, it'd be a little bit good or be all honest, you know. It ain't, it ain't the best. Also, you'll notice that it's completely shitting itself. Uh, I'm emulating this. By, by that I mean I'm playing this on a 360, but using the actual Fable disc. So, occasionally it just shits itself inside out. I think you can do flourishes eventually, but you have to build up your combat multiplier or some shit. I don't know, we're just going to use magic to kill everything, so it doesn't matter. Magic breaks the shit out of this game. Name one game that magic doesn't break the shit out of. Everybody got a boner for magic. A magic boner, if you will. Good job. That's the creepy bald man, and I don't no, ever want to see that. him again. The Beatles are all dead. You can come out of the woods now. I'm just, I tried to make a joke based on the band The Beatles, and then I realized I don't care enough. <laughs> Was there loot over here? No, there's a fence. Still got these gloves. I think when he grows up, his gloves grow with him. They're like a exoskeleton on a hermit crab. Is that how that works? Hermit crabs don't do that. They find shells. Stupid. Why don't you brush up on marine biology before you record a damn video. Shut up! Do you wish to leave your training behind? Yes. Yes, I do. Thank you. The guild was now the boy's life. Was it? You know what my life was? Listening to you talk, and then I skipped it. And I died. And it was the happiest I've ever been. Get out of bed, lazy bones. You yell at me a lot because you're such a proactive black woman who don't need no man. I'm just saying, we if theoretically, if I ever fight her in a coliseum, I'm probably going to kill her, but don't read too much into that. Also, you'll notice I'm slightly older. Look at his hands! Abe from Oddworld doesn't have as big and freaky as your hands. And he's a, a Mudok? Mudokin? He's a Hudokin, son. Ryu shooting Abe. The right... I touched the right stick and the game just loses fucking I can make the map all big, in case y'all were wondering. In case you were sitting on the edge of your seat biting your nails going, when's the gonna make that map big? I just did. So I assume you came all over yourself because you're a mini map fetish just which has to be a thing. Okay, let's do this shit. I never ran the race. I don't know I think there was something you could do as a kid. And who gives a shit? It just give me useless items I don't want. Hey, who do I talk to? Whose dick I got sucked in advanced training? Okay, there you are. He was like, "Tis my dick, good sir." You can put that old stick away. I can have the. Oh wow, a long sword. Huzzah! All right, I have to fight her. Let's see if I can remember the basics of CQC. Okay, you can roll. It's basically Dark Souls. I'm just saying, Dark Souls. You know, it's just complete fable ripoff. Dark Souls is fable if it was good. Me. Oh, what I'm, you waiting for? now I can do flourish and blocks. I, I can't rem, I can't be bothered to remember what store flourish and blots was in Harry Potter. I feel like it was might have been the bookstore. What time? Can it? You know what can save my life? You shut the fuck up for one second. All right, now we need to dodge. Hup! Oh. I, okay, you can hold the, the button down the block. Got you. Look at this. Look at this adaptive real-time combat. I bet troops in Afghanistan train using Fable. Some guy came in there and he was like, Hey guys, I'm new to the core. Let's play Full Spectrum Warrior. And they're like, Full Spectrum Warrior? More like Full Spectrum Warrior. It's Fable time, baby. I don't. I'm sorry. Support our troops by not making them play Fable. Are we fighting? 
Oh. I think her older brother is watching us now. I don't remember your name, character whose dialogue I keep skipping. Ah, it can't be any dumber than Maze. Her name must be Labyrinth. Okay. She's so surprised that I can roll. That's all wrong, Whisper. Whisper, okay. We know her name. That's good. So we'll know what the Yeah. I'd then love to. By the archery range to Peter, Peter Pumpkin Eater. Had a wife. And then made a shitty fucking RPG. <laughs> that sword is bigger than this boy. Why would you give a boy of I'm guessing 14 summers Are the biggest fucking sword on train? earth? Alright. I'm gonna train in archery. What if I train in archery with Archie Bunker? He's like, hey Edith, I'm training in here for Able Character. And she's like, oh, Archie, that series is so terrible. And he's like, shut up, Edith. The Peter Molyneux that he promised me I could plant an acorn and become a tree there. Jefferson. I'll never get tired of Archie Bunker. <laughs> well done. I hit targets. Thank you. I'm the best around and nothing's ever going to keep me. Okay. I keep forgetting. Okay, what button? Jesus. Okay, it's become uh, FPS. It has inverse aiming so that's throwing me off just a little bit and there's you and there's you and then the way in the back there oh so shamed such shame wow much missing that should have hit and that didn't hit but it should have ought to i've just you know the sun's in my eyes it's not my fault i need potassium my hands shaking there we go well, I hit you, damn target. I got hit on multiple times. What the fuck? What do you want, old man? You need to win a fucking Olympic medal? Maybe I have to hit it at full power. I tried. I did, old man. You don't know. Are you shitting me? I'm gonna hit shit out of target. You have no fucking idea. I, I mean, potentially. It's it's not. It's no whole moment full. Oh, this is timed. I have to get a score. Look, the arm shakes when you pull the bow back too far. Peter Molyneux is there putting his dick in your ear. He's like, you love it, you fucking slut. This here's Fable and you love it. Oh, don't you love it. Plant that acorn, baby. Plant that acorn. That's my Peter Molyneux. What? Did I pass? No! Next, we will learn about the ways. Oh, boy. I'm going to learn magic. So he's like, next, I'll teach you how to beat the whole fucking game. If the Xbox can ever load. Why is backwards compatibility so shitty and dumb? Can you want to practice melee combat? No. Can I practice getting your hoodie? Because it looks cool. He's like, I don't know. Can you practice not having big freaky lobster killing hands? I'm like, I'm sorry. Why do oh, lobsters fear me? That church chest is mine. Fat loot. Oh, sorry. I need silver keys. I probably have to download an app and pre-order and a premium bonus. Beverage! Okay. There's just the will. Magic. You cast magic, I cast it's magic! Teach me magic. Magic fucking jump. Up to three powers. Yeah, that's right. You hold this and then you shoot fucking goddamn lightning. Emperor, this game is prequel to Emperor Palpatine. It's a prequel to the Star Wars prequels. Okay, we're just fucking fast swapping that shit. You don't understand how badly this shit breaks the fucking game, dude. The game gets bent over so badly, and it doesn't even like it. The game only lets you do it because it's your birthday. The game's like, fine, I'll give up the ass for your magic dick on your birthday. And you're like, damn right you will, sweetheart. I'm a, I am need mana. Alright, is that good enough for you, Clint? Clint Johnson? Excellent use I really don't remember his name. Well he might not have one. No. Very good, lad. You have learned. You've the learned the three basic fucking JRPG cookie ready. cutter classes. You dumb shit. The skills quickly. You know what you mastered shutting the fuck up. No wait, you're still an apprentice. Ooh. Before you graduate, there is one final test. He's like, you must suck three dicks. It's not. It's just not funny. Nobody likes dick jokes. Dick jokes always come up a little short. How long have I been playing this? Because it feels like my entire life. I've been playing this for like 25 fucking minutes. What a tragedy. What a tragedy. Why? 
Why do we fall into fable? Master Molyneux. I suppose you're wondering. I'm wondering why you keep appearing in front of me and also if you'll ever age. Okay, we need to fight him, I guess. Magic, magic, magic. I guess he doesn't care. I don't know. Oh, 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 oh. So good. Wow. Much better. Very good. Oh, Jesus. I just literally just master the basics of CQC or whatever this shit is. All right, where are you at? I'm on bow the... Oh, he's over here. Listen to that music. That is very Snake Eater-esque music. Good. Or quick. Is this really teaching me anything? Go on. Excellent. And now cast lightning on me. Lightning returns. I wouldn't inflict lightning on anybody. That bitch. There. Did we beat the game yet? That's enough. Spoilers. This is just one episode. We just do this and then it ends. And I go home. I don't know how I don't. I'm already in my house, but I still go home. Listen to that ambient noise. That's the power of the Xbox. I assume the only way to play this game is on one of those limited edition Mountain Dew Xboxes that the kids are always talking about. Them damn kids need to shut the fuck up. Play on an RC Cola Xbox. Nope. I won't. I shan't watch this scene. I don't care what it is. And neither do you. Let the apprentice. Oh, yeah. Me and, uh. What was her name? Whisper Quiet. We graduated. And I'm like, see you in that Coliseum. I think I might see her before that Coliseum, but still. It's time for you. Okay. I have to level up. Look at me. I'm so you young and cut short. You wish to advance in. Okay. Strength? Ah, you've chosen will. You could be a powerful magic. Let's see. Do I need any other spells? You wish to learn. I don't need fireball. Uh, I don't have enough experience to level up lightning. Uh, <laughs> it's just called force push. That's actually really useful. And uh, the problem is, if you level up wheel, you become an old man really fast until eventually you're older than your mother. Spoilers: you meet your mother in the game. Assassin's Rush is supposed to make you appear behind an enemy. It doesn't work. I mean, it's never worked. And or I could just become more powerful. Your capacity for storing mana. Yeah, that's what we want. Okay. Oh yeah, you get different There's flavors of experience too. It's so fucking complicated. Like you get base general experience, but you get experience based on the things you do. And if you eat carrots, I'm not even fucking joking. You can get like dexterity experience. You hear you hear what he just said? You're gonna hear that a lot. Um. Oh yeah, check the guild for more quests. I can ask quests. I think I have to kill a bee. Yeah. That's right, I have to kill a, a, a bee. Take quest. Okay. Um. Okay, yeah, we have to go there. I feel like you can eventually fast travel. But I don't, I don't even really remember. It's all a fucking daze to me, dude. This whole game was a fever dream. And when I woke up... I was like, boy, glad that nightmare's over. And then when I threw the covers back, Peter Molyneux was under them, laying on his side with a rose in his mouth, holding a bag of acorns, and I just started screaming. And that's how my story ends. Peter Molyneux is the only game developer to piss me off more than Shigeru Miyamoto. Also, I can still fart and giggle. <laughs> that was the perfect punctuation to that. My character's like, you think I give one half of two shits about a wasp attack? Okay, hold on, the camera is too busy climbing up my asshole. He's like, oi, I got to escort you to the quest area, I do. In me white pants, even though it's past Labor Day. Can no one fight wasp? Look how big my mana bar is. It's the game's over. Way. Please, you've got to save my friends. Do I? I ain't got to do nothing. This fable, the world is my oyster. Behold, acorns. Oh, but I don't have a dog. Peter, why? Why did it take the power of the 360 to be able to make out with a dog? Why do you cheat me every step away? Okay, the scene is there, bees. Bees! Chris fucking Farley comes running out of the woods. My guy's like, oh, hey there, bees. Uh, spoilers, lightning. Yeah, for saving me. you're fucking welcome, you shit. 
do, 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 do. Oh, wait, I can do fat experience. Actually, uh, yeah, let's keep shooting lightning, lightning. Lightning is so good when it's not a female version of Cloud Strife. I'm not going to stop making that joke. You think I will. Hey, sweetheart, honey, guess what? Lightning. I'm not. Who am I? I don't want to target her. I want to target the bees. Stupid. I'm not even joking. The first time I beat this game, the final boss, I'm not going to tell you who he is because it's such a plot twist. But um, I circle strafed around him while shooting lightning. I'm not even going to pretend to fucking lie to you. Okay, here's the wasp queen. How will I ever defeat her? Wasps. Strike down her wasp. Okay, look. She's wasp killing time, baby. Because I'm wasp tired. Yep. No when to wasp them, no when to wasp them. Okay, now that I'm out of that, pull your bow out. And... Okay, I pulled my bow out. So, okay, yeah, I have to hold this button now. We're just having a grand old fucking time shooting this wasp with arrows, aren't we? Why can I hear that creepy old man in my head? He won't... He ends every sentence with lots of that. Okay, pull the sword out. Let's go aboard this fucking thing with the pot of neck moons. There, we used all of our disciplines. I learned something today. He did it! He's the only one we just ordered and can cast lightning. His sword be clipping through his ass cheeks and we not are scared. Who's this one? Now? Even though that's a clear sign of a whip. Oh, I have the wasp head now, which means I can walk up to people and be like, Hey, motherfucker, you ever seen a wasp head, baby? And, uh, then they're like, No, that's terrible, I haven't. Okay, let's see. Trophies. You have received this email. Assigned to left. Okay. So now, yeah. Uh, items. This is there's so much. Huh? That's right. Health potion. We want you there. Wheel potion. We want you there. Okay. So that that appears when you hold right trigger. Okay. Why is it default to farting and and guffawing? I don't, I don't. Oh yeah, that's like your hearthstone. Gotcha. Hey, dick shits! Fucking wasp head! Oh, I'm sorry, that was like me. I didn't, I didn't mean that. You don't understand. Yes. Uh, I can't. I, I can. You, can you even in the wasp head? There. Now they think I'm awesome. Wow! This mechanic has a purpose. I care not what it is. I want to unequip farts from my fart button, but I can't. It's perma farts. Repellent? You just showed you a wasp head, you dumb shit. 